Hello, my fellow citizens of the 7th universe. My name is Fatplay, and if you wish this video, welcome back once again to Dragon Block Crazy Craft. Yes, it's been a little bit actually since we've actually been on the server, and the only thing was that because I couldn't get out of that dimension before, that was killing my frames. Yeah, that was fun. Um, but I uh, managed to get out, managed to get back home somehow. Jesus. And um, I have friends down there. Yeah, I have like my own little ant farm thing because uh, of these beautiful, beautiful termite blocks. Yeah, freaking amazing. But uh, welcome back once again to Dragon Ball Crazy Craft, where last episode we got new level of Super Saiyan, we got super powerful, and um, we left it off on that. Last question of the day was um, which race you would want to be a Saiyan? Yeah, I'm not saying, well, yeah, saying the Mechie and that sort of stuff. Everyone just said Saiyan because they're like, I want to go God. I want to go God. So, obviously, everyone was Saiyans. I would actually prefer being like an android because I'd be like a human. And I'd still appreciate human things. But I can wreck Super Saiyans. So, I mean, why the heck not? <laughs> but uh, the next question of the day, we're going to um, take of it because uh, the new arc in Dragon Ball Super is about to begin. So, the question is... The question is, how pumped are you for that arc? Survival arc. Like, seriously, how pumped are you? I am... I actually got to say how pumped I am. You could probably... You could probably imagine, but... I'm not gonna say how pumped your hand. Empty your hand. Don't tell me what to do. I'm eating. But, uh... Yeah, this is a very, very easy way of getting experience. If you, uh... For people who have, um... Never, like... Like, realized how to level up pretty quickly. With the TP game that we have set right now to a crazy amount... Killing these termites all of a sudden give us tons of stuff. So like look at that my constitution going extremely up We getting ow. We're getting all ow. We're getting all all Of the stuff that we need in order to um, level up so freaking fast like look at this We're probably gonna do this. We're probably gonna be yeah one time. We already have enough again So we're gonna buff up the strength. Oh, yeah And then um the only thing is that with the creeper, the reason why they're doing this is the creeper repellent that I have set up. Um, it kind of freaks, it freaks out the ant, it freaks out these termites. The guy's still here some. I think they're over, I think there's, yeah, there's some over here. Jeez! Hello, friends. Yeah, these guys, uh, ants is the number one ways of trying to level up. I don't know how strong everyone else is on the server. I think, honestly, the only one who really does anything really on the server now is probably uh, Jinji. I know Mitch wants to do it, and I think Mitch has access to the um, has access to the server. So I think he's been trying to get on here soon, so that's good. Um, Jinji, I know, is still doing series on this server. Um, I mean, and then you think of, like, Immo and Zaro, then you, you already know the answer to that one. Um, but, uh, yeah, so... 104 the currently change we're gonna bump up actually our endurance a little bit bump it out up a little bit and there we go uh we're getting strong we're still pretty dang weak we're not gonna be able to do much in this um this current state that we're in uh for this we have to gather cooked dino meat which um basically that just means that just means that we have to go around and get a bunch of dino meat which can be good or cannot be good because obviously Obviously for that stuff. It's like we have to like gather like 10 raw beat 10 raw um, We have to gather 10 raw uh, uh, Dino meats and cook them up. We have one. So I think honestly This is just for this is for science. This is for this is for science one two three four five six seven eight nine There we go. Honestly don't really like use this stuff anyway. So oh, yeah lightning stones and black iron Jeez, some like weird stuff we got going on there. Honestly, I need more room. I need more space. I'm gonna chuck this out, chuck that out for the time being, and plug that bad boy in. There we go. That should be good. That should be good. Hopefully, actually, like it doesn't like Jin's mod doesn't like uh yell like yell at me that like I'm using um that like I cheated those in. I wonder if I don't think it's gonna happen, but it's possible. Um Spawn attack squid. Oh, yeah, I can spawn all these attack squids. It'd be like, hello, attack squid. Come, come to fight me. Um, I don't need this dirt. I'm just gonna, like, throw in as much stuff as I can right now. Just see. I don't know what's in this. I need another chest. I honestly do. But, um... I can chuck the Cyberman seeds in there. No apples. Golden apples. 
that in there. All right, so that's like all the room I have. I don't, I don't need these. I don't need these guys. Um, honestly, a freaking laser gun is always nice. We don't need potatoes. Um, how are we doing over here in this? We're at five. Is that counting? It is not counting. Aw, man. Are you serious? Oh, yes, it is. Sweet. <laughs> Good. Um, but, uh, yeah, so I actually need to go grab, like, wood. Where's the tree? Is there a tree? That's the only thing about this place, too. There's, like, no trees around here. Okay, there's trees up there, but, like, seriously. All right, I'm, in cur I'm currently still in creative, so let me get out of that. Um, let me actually, like, go up here and, like, gather some trees for, like, you know, storage purposes. Storage purposes! Storage purposes! Need to cut all the trees for storage purposes. Come on. There we go. Because we need, we, <laughs> we need more chests. We also need a roof over my house. We need lots of things. It's, like, episode 8 already, and I don't really have that much. I need to, like, do that. I was never a build- I'm never a building person. I never go around and actually build because I'm, like, terrible at building. I'm, like, the worst when it comes to building. I'm good at, like, certain things, but building houses and stuff? Nah, not my forte, unfortunately. Um, but do not worry. Do not fret, my friends. We will make sure we do this. After we do this, I think we're gonna continue on the Dragon Box Z, um, quest system. I don't think that- Do we have the space pod? I don't know if we have a space pod. Hmm. Weird. Um... Uh, I like how it's snowing over here. Is it snowing in my house? It's snowing in my house. Nope, it's raining here. Weird. Um, but I'm just gonna make apparently five chests. Perfect. That's that's fine by me. And then one right there, because eventually that's gonna be put thrown in there. We're just gonna chuck everything in there that we don't really need. We don't really need a lot of this stuff right now, so that's fine. Um, the other five should be done by now. Yep. And are we good? I have all 10, right? There we go. Complete. Now, is that good? I have to be in... Dirty Stony... What the? Dirty Stony? What the heck is Stony? Do you just mean, like, the... Do you just mean the Rocky Biome? Is this what you mean? Yeah, it is. Okay, that's just weird. Why is it called Dirty Stony? Be in Dirty Stony... Kill Nappa, kill Vegeta. And I'm assuming that, yeah, they're, they're going to do this. So I have to spawn them in naturally. Uh, what's the scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000! Actually, it's like, right now it's actually only 500. So technically your scouter is kind of busted, Vegeta. Your scouter is busted because, like, even at, like, 200%, I don't have that. But this is going to be a little bit tough, I think, trying to beat up, uh... Wait, I don't have the... It takes a dino meat away? What? I don't have the dino meat anymore. Did I put the dino meat away? I might have put it away. But like, what? I don't have the dino meat. That's weird. All right, so we have to do, um, if I do DBC spawn and then Vegeta and then Nappa. There we go. They should be, ow! Nappa. Yeah, Nappa doesn't like me. Vegeta, they are ridiculously strong. Like, doing it like this way. Oh god, they're both after me. Why don't you do it like in the actual anime and let me beat one of you up and then the other one spawns? I could have just, like, spawned in one at a time. But you know what? I don't care. Come on, Nappa. Let's do this. Nappa. Nappa. Vegeta. Vegeta. Oh, what is this? No, come on. Wow, you were destroying- you just do not care about the environment, do you, Nappa? Do you? I can turn into Nappa now. Alright, now it's time to beat up Vegeta. Vegeta, I hope you like death and pain and suffering. Because, uh, wow. We are- we are getting deeper and deeper. <laughs> Jesus. Ow, stop this! I mean, there's iron over there. I might go grab some after this fight, but like, Vegeta. Stop it with this nonsense. I like how the blasts are actually doing like more damage than his punches, which would make sense, but like still. And that should be it, right? Yeah, 414 right there. And protect, and I don't think, oh, did I? Oh, it gives me, it actually gives me a space pod now. Oh, okay, cool. Um, so we could actually go to Namek right now and like defeat all the 
But I think that the... Oh, crap. I wonder how the Frieza soldiers are going to work. Because uh, Frieza soldiers are a little bit weird. Because obviously they spawn on you like the Cybermen. And they're going to die right away. So we're going to have to spawn in Frieza soldiers. Like, Is it like... I wonder if it's uh, like DBC spawn... Is it like Frieza soldier? You cannot spawn that. You cannot spawn freeze. Oh, maybe it's like F R E E, because that's how he kind of spells it. Yeah, it's Frieza Soldier One that will pop up, and you can't spawn them in this dimension. So yeah, that's how he, he spells it. F R E E. What a what a noob. Um, but uh, let's see. We can bump up the we can bump up this, and we can bump up that. So there we go. That was a pretty decent amount of TP right there. Let's continue onwards. Let's go ahead to freaking Nabok. All right, so hopefully things are gonna be a little hectic over here at first because it's, because these uh these guys are gonna spawn on me. Bad things are gonna happen. I think they're gonna spawn. Are you good? Good thing about this area though is, dang, the dinos have so much freaking health. I forgot about that. Why? You have like as much health as like Nappa. I mean, you're gonna do like no damage, but like, dang, I forgot you guys have like this much health. Why? Why? Boy, I thought, like, I was going to go around the store and be like, ah, I could probably, like, three-shot these guys. No. You can only three-shot these guys if you're, like, in Super Saiyan 3. But there we go. Dino meat. I mean, it's easy TP, so. That's the one good thing about this area, too, is that there's so... Look, look at all these dinos. I don't know why the dinosaurs spawn so much more frequently than in, um, than in, uh, like, in the actual, like, Dirty Stony, apparently, now it's called, but the Rocky Biomes, like... I don't know why that that's changed, but I mean, it's easy TP now to come over here. This is why I was like looking forward to come over to Namek because this is like the area to get as much TP as possible because these dinos are like ridiculously overpowered when it comes to their health. Their strength, not so much, but they're like, they're like uh, health wise. Oh yeah, it's like, it's, it's amazing how strong these guys are. I wonder what mod it is that actually like puts or like what plugin put makes all the entities like this much stronger i honestly don't know like i just kind of plopped the mod pack in there there's a lot of mods i don't know so i'm not sure like what mod pack makes you do this i mean what mod but like dang i'm gonna pop up the strength bike too there we go all right so let's see if this works you spawned yep all right so we have to kill uh oh wait i do this and then there they go freeze the soldier freeze the soldier freeze the soldier dang you have to kill three they have to kill three of each of them. Wow. So this is Freezing Soldier 1. So let's kill off... Let's kill off uh, three of these guys. Three of the other guys. And three of the other guys. Interesting. I didn't realize that. Like, before it was just you killed 12. It was kind of it. So we do this. Freezing Soldier. Hey, guy. How you doing, my man? After this, we gotta, like, actually go defeat Kui. Which is, like, gonna be... Stupidly strong. Um, there's that, and then boom. Actually, I'm not even looking forward to facing, like, the Ginyu Force. The Ginyu Force is actually gonna probably wreck me. Oh, God. I'm actually kinda scared about the Ginyu Force. Who's scared about the Ginyu Force, usually? Not me, but apparently that's gonna happen if we hit two. Hey, we got Mr. Mr. McBeard over here. I always wonder, like, what the heck was up, like, up with these guys. Because these guys looked cool. They looked like they were wise, old, like, like aged men but they just get one-shotted by like two-year-olds so like i don't know i don't know what's up with these guys also like the pool race i mean the pools are cool not really but the pool i like the pool i like this like i like the fact that like he was like the weakling and you would just like find it hilarious these guys are doing like a lot more these guys are doing a lot more um like key blast than like they usually would at least I'm blocking them now. Haha. <laughs> you cannot stop the block. It doesn't do that much damage when I block, I don't think. There we go. And then we gotta kill off one more, I believe. So let's do this. Let's go! You freaking freaking nature. There we go. Come on. Ow, rude. Alright. This is easy. I mean, thankfully, this is gonna give us lots of TP just by punching these guys. Because like. Now it's time for the pools. Where are you, a pool? Let's do this, a pool. Their key blasts are annoying me. Like, cause usually these guys would have like a hundred something health, 
And, well, actually, they probably have, like, 200 now or something. Because he upped the, he upped the health on most of these entities. But, like, dang. These guys have so much health now, it's ridiculous. But don't worry, I like it. I like it a lot. Because it's easy TP. Also, it's, like, exciting. Because I'm, like, actually kind of, like, thinking, like, I have to, like, do some things. Like, I have to actually train in order to face some of these entities now. Because, like, the Ginyu Force is going to be extremely strong. Because, like... In all of my series, where, where's the, oh, you're there. Poor pool, he's suffocating in the wall. Can I actually punch him when he's in? No, he got out of it. Um, but like, in the other series that I usually do, um, especially like Dragon Block C, Battle of C, or like Xenoverse, um, Dragon Block Xenoverse, that sort of stuff, or Dragon Block Heroes, the Dragon Block C saga system is one of the easiest things that you can actually, like, that you, that you can do. Especially, like, the Namekian parts. Like, it's just, like, spawn Kui, one shot. Spawn Zarbon, one shot. Spawn the Doria, one shot. Spawn Ginyu Force, each of them one shot. Frieza comes, okay, fine, you do a two shot. But, like, seriously, it's, like, all easy. So, like, now the fact that, like, these guys are so much more stronger, and it just makes, it makes the whole saga system, like, so much more, like, exciting. Like, whoa, hello, hello, other, other, um other dinosaur i called you a dragon for some reason i'm gonna sit here and eat some corn while i'm okay you okay with that cool all right just want to make sure okay this dino these dinosaurs are driving me insane now which i'm fine with but like stop it i'm beating up i'm beating you people ups i wonder how long it would take to actually beat this thing up if i like went to like five ten percent because like <laughs> like, I'm at 100% right now. I'm only doing, like, 90 to him. So, it's like... We're, I'm not doing any damage to him in 100%. Makes me kind of scared of, like, what would happen if I did that. If I was in 10%. But, how much have we got? 821! Jeez! Talk about TP gain. Wow. Alright, um... I think we're actually kind of close to actually getting a new form of Super Saiyan. Well, we're actually close to getting, like, the next one. Um, yeah, we, I, I'm just gonna spawn in, uh, DBC, spawn, and Kui. I think we'll be able to, not DBS, wow, DBC, couldn't spawn Kui. Why couldn't you spawn Kui? Is it, oh, it's Kiwi, I think it's called. Is it Kiwi? Yeah, it's Kiwi, that's what I thought. His name is Kui. Like, even in my damage indicators, you can't see it. But yeah, its name is Kui, but the entity is Kiwi. I don't know why. It's weird. <laughs> A little faxy, you know. That, like, Jin has, like, some of the entities, like, spelt completely different than they actually are. Like, Kui being Kiwi. I think that's the, uh, I think that's, like, the Jap... That's gotta be the Japanese translation of his name, is Kiwi. Because, I mean, if you look at it, that, like, most, if not all, of... The people the Kira Toriyama made for name wise, he just looked into his fridge and it, it was just like, here's Raditz for radishes, here's Kakarot for carrot, here's Vegeta's for vegetables, Piccolo is a pickle, um, that sort of stuff, yeah. Like, it's some people don't know that. And I kind of like when I bring up that fact to some people, like, like to some of my friends, they're just like, what, how do you figure out the names for all these guys? I'm like, he looked in his fridge and they're just like, my god. It makes sense. All right, and then we should have yeah. Next is the Doria. Um, we have six. Wow. We next form would be a thousand. Yeah, next form would be a thousand, and we'd be actually able to get Super Saiyan three. But um, hello dinosaur. I don't think we'll be actually to hold on to Super Saiyan three at all though. Our KP game is we our our charge rate is so low. I just want to be able to get that get that transformation all the way up, just in case we fight some like extremely crazy um, baddies. Because in the future we're going to be able to face some extreme baddies. Like even in this mod pack, like the fact that Dragon Block C here, um, Dragon Block C, I don't even think it's the strongest mod pack in this. It might be like number two, but like, okay, well, punching wise and like battling wise and like damage wise. Dragon Box C kills everything. But, like, health-wise, I think there's stuff that are going to be a lot more stronger than the stuff in Dragon Box C. Like, stronger than 2,500. Because, I mean, there are, like, certain mods that you can do, like, 200 damage on things. So, I'm assuming that there's probably going to be, like, some entities that do, like, like 10,000 health. 
Or if not, I just spawn them in with custom NPCs at some point, and then we'll just like do absolute crazy stuff. Oh, look at that. It's not raining anymore. Aw. I'm just going to beat up this last dino, and then there's two here. Yep. Away. Um, 361, not bad. All right, so next up, obviously, is Dodoria. But I think I'm going to end this episode here because we actually did a lot. We got through the saga system. We we're getting stronger. But first off, I want to see... I want to see, like, what we are for, uh, strength-wise, getting an Ascended Super Saiyan. Like, that's some pretty, that's some pretty awesome stuff right there. And X is that for some reason. But I do 344 damage now in this form. I mean, obviously, that form is going to be, like, useless in the future because I it's going to take up so much stamina to even punch some people. And Super Saiyan 3 is going to be so much better. But, you know what? It's fine. I don't know how much stronger I am compared to Jinji, but uh, I want to say I'm getting there. I'm getting close. But, uh, yeah, on that note, everybody, I am going to say thank you guys for joining once again. Remember, the question of the day is, how pumped are you about the new Saga system, uh, so Saga in Dragon Ball Super? How freaking pumped are you? All right, so I'm going to say thank you guys for joining once again, and I will be seeing you later!